we all have good days and bad days. So it's a good idea to A-B your work often enough and sometimes to roll back your edits and redo them when you're in a better or fresher mood. Let me show you how easy this is with Melodyne. The compare button gives you an A-B comparison acoustically, like a normal bypass switch, but also visually, with grey blobs reflecting the original state of the unaltered audio. As you toggle the button, the blobs will jump, telling you that some pitch adjustments were made, for example here, or elsewhere you may see changes to the curve, so either the pitch drift or pitch modulation tool was used there. You can quickly check this by looking at the inspector values. And so it's that easy to identify any edit that has taken place so far. But what if you feel like some of your edits have been a little bit too much? Of course you can roll back with undo step by step, but for the price that undoing something you did on, say, the day before yesterday, you will also undo everything that happened after that. So you probably lose many good edits as well. Of course, we have a solution for that. Select a single blob or a section in question. Right-click to open the floating toolbox. For each tool there are specific add-ons. One of them is called Restore Original. This allows you to undo specific actions regardless of when or in what order you have previously performed them. For example, if your client comes in today and doesn't like how you flattened the pitch curve, just take that away but without sacrificing what else you did with that sequence of notes. Or you want to start from scratch, but only for one specific phrase, and only in terms of timing, not pitch. It's as simple as that. Okay, hope you've seen something new in this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.